Okay, so y'all see the big box, so y'all already know, like, this is gonna be a major haul. Everything in this box total is worth $153. We got nail supplies, nail art, and things to organize your nail stuff with. Everything is beginner friendly, um, it's super, super cheap. Basically, I just needed some nail supplies. I always check Shein first because Shein has all the cheaper options, obviously. So if you wanna save a little money and you're just getting into nails and you wanna know what you can buy to get started, keep on watching because this video is definitely for you. I just wanna go ahead and get into it. So let's go ahead and get into our notification shout outs first. Shout out to these three people who were the first three people to comment on my last video. Thank you guys so much for having your post notifications turned on and if you would like a shout out just like these three people all you have to do is make sure you are subscribed to my channel and make sure you have your post notifications turned on that way you can possibly be one of the first three people to comment and you will get a shout out just like these three people here all right so before we get into it i just want to let you know this package came to me in about two weeks time i was pretty shocked honestly because i thought it was going to take longer than that but yeah here it is so let's see what we got I can see I done took some stuff out here, but um, I'm gonna start with some of the storage stuff that I bought. So I bought these little storage boxes to store my poly gels in, cause I really wanna get them out of the boxes that they come in once I order them and into smaller boxes just so I can consolidate all of my stuff. And this is really the best way to do that possible. It actually fits a lot of poly gels and they stack well on top of each other. So on Shein, they're called Clear Drawer Storage Box. Okay, the smallest one is $3, the medium one is $5, and the large one is $8. And I got the largest one, so I paid $8 for each of these and I bought three. But you can see the different sizes that they have online and you can pick which size that you want. You can pretty much put anything you want to in here though, which is the beauty of all of these storage cases. But yeah, that's this one. And then in that same category, I bought three medium boxes and each of these were $5. I don't know what I'm gonna store in these yet, but I'm doing some moving around here in um, my little filming space so I got quite a few things I could fit in here that's what these are for but next up more storage bins this one was called the nail art tool storage box and it's two in one so you get both of these for four dollars and I honestly just wanted it for this bigger box that comes sectioned because I want to put my sanding bands in here or my lint free wipes in here so yeah and then i'll find something to do with the little box on top but i think for four dollars this is great speaking of lint free wipes i purchased some from shein so this is a box of 180 lint free wipes i promise you this will come very handy in doing nails and it's only two dollars on shein so definitely put this in your car for your next purchase and since we're already in the nail supply mood with the lint free wipes it's only right that we move on to the the dental bib. Now I don't think they're called dental bibs on Shein but that's basically what these are. On Shein they're called nail table mat. Basically what this is is paper towel but it's the type of paper towel that you need when you're doing nails because this one absorbs liquid way better than regular paper towel. If you spill monomer or acetone or whatever type of liquid and you spill it on top of this it will not leak through. It will stay on this mat and I bought three of them because I go through these really really quickly they come 20 in a pack and they're only a dollar 50 each and let me tell you they're way more on Amazon so get you some from Shein and save some money now I have all my dental bibs and I need something to store them in well guess what I bought it from Shein okay so I could store them in here this is like a little tissue box so I'm gonna fold these up place them in there and then you know just pull them out whenever I need one and that way I don't have the little package just sitting all over the place so on Shein it's called clear tissue storage box and it was actually $14 of course you can put a variety of things in here you can put you know your gloves or if you want to put actual tissue in here I don't know but um yeah that's just what I'm gonna put in here my dental bibs so this one is called the one piece three grid desk storage box and looking at it something Thing looks like it's missing so we're definitely missing the dividers in this I don't know if they're like sold separately 
it might be because I don't see them here and I bought this because it had little sections in it and now looks like I have to buy the little sections separately okay for $17 I need the sections I don't know if this was like a mistake just with my product that they sent me but yeah it's still a super cute little box it has a handle on it and a little clasp in the front and it's really really cute but i mean i need my dividers my section so um we can just set that to the side maybe somewhere in this box if it is i'll come back and you know do the whole thing but we'll see this is just something to make my life a little easier when i'm dealing with my nail stickers they're all in this little bag here and every time like taking this out and digging through it and seeing which one i want and whatever it's just exhausting so i bought this little booklet little thingy thing to store all of my nail stickers in and i can just slide them in the little plastic little piece this way i can organize them by color or you know separate the butterfly nail stickers from i don't know whatever other nail stickers that i have and i have like quite a few nail stickers this is not my only baggie i have like two other baggies like this filled with nail stickers that i get from brands and stuff that i buy so um i bought two of these little booklets and each one costs 214 I don't even know what this is. Okay, so this is another little storage box that I purchased. This one is called Clear Storage Box on Shein and it was $13. So um, this one has little sections on the side, little dividers, and then it has a bigger side that leaves more room for you to put more stuff in. But it also has this little insert here. And if you drop it down to the bottom, it looks like it can hold something right there whatever you want i don't know what i will put in those little circles i have a few things in mind that i want to store in here so that's why i purchased it and I, now that i'm thinking about it i should have got another one this baby right here this is another storage box i bought a lot of storage stuff as y'all can see so this one might be my favorite it is big and spacious it can fit a lot of things that are long and tall i bought two of these really easy to open up close and it's super cute so it's actually called a clear makeup brush storage bucket but of course we're not putting makeup brushes in it if you want to put your makeup brushes in it you can do that but um this is not that type of video it's all about nails so i'm going to put all either all of my nail art brushes in here or i'm going to put my nail files i bought two so i can probably put my nail files in one and then my nail art brushes in another only three dollars it's like 374 so yes i love this for me i'm not gonna lie y'all i thought i was gonna have to do a two-part video but it looks like we're gonna get this done all in one video so let's keep it rolling so by the looks of this you should already know what this is if you have been in the nail world for a while so this is just a little nail soap bowl you can use it to soak your nails off with acetone and um i just really needed one so i just bought it it was only a dollar fifty on shein and you have the choice between um blue and pink and of course i chose the pink for me i feel like it's quicker to soak your nails in warm water and with this bowl you can put the warm water at the bottom and then the acetone on top so that's why i bought that and then i also bought this little container so i use this to soak my brushes and i already have one actually but i just wanted to buy another one because i kind of lost the top to my last one i definitely use it to clean my brushes so whether it's a, an acrylic brush or one of my nail brushes i just put whatever liquid i I need to put in here to clean the brushes and i just sit them in there so they can soak and then they have little brush holders at the top it's really helpful and that container was 161 on shein and it's called nail art pen cleaner cup all right and next we have these little display nails so with these you get 50 pieces in each little baggie so each one that you purchase you get 50 of them and um you can get clear or white and i chose clear and they are 150 a piece so yeah i need these badly oh i ordered them in different nail shapes oh i didn't even know you can get them in different nail shapes so 
one of them i ordered in like a coffin nail shape and then the other one i ordered in a stiletto nail shape i didn't even notice that i did that so the coffin shape display nails was 161 and 50 pieces so you get a lot more with the coffin shape ones and then here i bought some stiletto ones you only get 32 pieces for 161 so i mean you get more bang for your buck with the coffin shape ones so yeah i will say get these definitely i didn't even notice i bought like two different shapes that goes to show you, I just be throwing things in my car. Okay, so next we can do some rhinestones. So I bought quite a few different rhinestones. So first I have like an assortment of different kind of rhinestones, different colors, different shapes. Honestly, whenever I see something that I like rhinestone wise, when I'm purchasing things off of Shein, I just grab it. I just like to have all different types of rhinestone. <laughs> that way I have like a variety of different things to choose from whenever I'm doing content. So this little rhinestone box is called um, Geometric Rhinestone Nail Art Decoration and it was $38. Now this ain't cheap. Now this was a little high, I'm not even gonna lie. But if you want to get them a little cheaper, you have to buy them in the smaller assortment. I have a few here. So I bought some rhinestones in little clusters and this one was $6.42. You get different colors in here and then I bought some that are all of the same color and this one was actually $2.14. So it depends on how much you get in each pack which will depend on the price. But in this little baggie, you get 10 pieces for $2. And then in this one with a different assortment, you get 30 for $6. So it honestly just depends on how many rhinestones you get in each, but you still can find some rhinestones for cheap. Don't mind that $38 one that I just showed you guys, but I mean, you see how many rhinestones you get in this one, which is why it costs as much as it does. I got a another little rhinestone kit and it was four dollars and 28 cents and all of these are like silver ones there's 12 in a pack and each one is like a different shape and size and then moving on still with some nail art here so i bought these because these are very popular nowadays like if you look on instagram you will see a lot of nails with these little things on them i'm not sure what they're called actually they look like little pearls to me they favor like little Little raindrops and I bought them just for content I want to do some nails with these in them so yeah I got this one for two dollars and fifty cents um, they come in colors of green blue purple pink silver and the little multi-color one and I thought those were super cute and I also bought just plain white ones on the side it comes in a little baggie and this one was one dollar and sixty one cents I'm telling you for the low y'all can get it okay we're coming down to the last few things this right here you've seen these in a lot of my videos these are little display dots they come with little um adhesive little sticky tabs that you can put them on whatever you like um in the picture on Shein you see they have them with um nail polish bottles you can put them on top to see what color nail polish it is but I normally use these for acrylic. That way I can see what color the acrylic actually is without opening up the jar and seeing what color is on the inside. And I needed some more, so here we are. I got some more. And this is $2.14 for 120 pieces. So you get a good bit for only $2. All right, last five things. So I really wanted to get more into press-on nails. I don't do them much, but I want to do them for myself, but also make content with it. So um, I bought a couple things for press-on nails. So I got some nail stands here and um, it comes with five little stands and then one diamond to kind of hold the stand up and they're magnetic. Honestly, I really thought the diamond was gonna be bigger than what it actually is it's a little smaller but i'm still going to use it then to hold the nail in place i have the little tacky putty i was surprised to see this on shein but they actually had it so the stand was 268 and then the tacky putty was 321 but anywho speaking of press on nails i bought press on nails 
So I just bought these plain press on nails from Shein just because I want to customize them. I just wanted to give myself a challenge to see what different nail designs I can do just with these plain press on nails. So um, yeah, that's content coming soon. And they also come with some rhinestones as well, it looks like in the pack. And they are $6.42. So I got a little nail dust cleaning brush. That's what it's called on Shein. I just really needed it to clean my drill bits, honestly. Then I purchased this for 161. And then lastly, I have these nail art brushes. So yeah, mainly for nail art, um, they come in five different sizes and they were 161. And that is everything that I purchased from Shein. I really hope this unboxing was helpful to anybody that's looking to start doing nails or anybody looking for cheaper nails supplies just to recap this right here did not come with the little dividers i looked all through the box i could not find it it was nowhere to be found yeah i'm still going to use it though but if you like this video make sure you go ahead and subscribe and hit that like button for any additional stuff that i purchased from shein i will be sure to record it for you guys and unbox it because i know y'all like this type of content so yeah thank you for watching if you watched this far and i will see you guys in my very next video